miles left. See you hiding down there with your boyfriend. That's gross, kid. Although I ain't gonna judge what you do with any dead body. However you get your kicks, you know. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't. What's your name? Ruffy. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Mine. I didn't steal it. All right, good. I don't like thieves. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on. Scoot. I ain't gonna wait forever. You take me to Statesboro? Trying to get to my grand's house. Oh, she likes to party? Just get in, we'll get there. Or somewhere, eventually. Oh. Name's Nate, by the way, thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh. Here you go. I don't want that shit. This shit? You don't know what you're talking about. I damn near died procuring this. I got half a mind to make you try it. You can't make me do anything. <laughs> okay, tough guy. We both know that ain't true, but okay. It'll do you some fucking good. You wanna tell me about where you come from at least? You must have been with a crew. Any tail back where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. No, uh, tail. Damn. I retract my question. There was a girl who I liked, all right. The argument's semantics, Russ. Give a pal the deets. All right. There was seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They're all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. If we found survivors, it was the same every time. He. Let it out, Paco. Just, we gonna kill these folks and take their stuff or what? Then bang, they'd be dead. Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rat? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. 
Sure, whatever. Sure, whatever? Come on. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck? Come on, scale of one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was knocked, right? I think. Here, get a look. Fuck! Like a nine, right? Get off me! Maybe you got high standards. Help! If you say five, I'm gonna flip. Tell me, Russ. I'll kill you. Damn it! No, you won't. You're no problem. Damn it! Would you load that? Bullets in the glove there. Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. Alright. Oh shit! Go! Get out! Russ! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! Okay, get ready! Don't stop running! And keep your head down! Good hustle! What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did! Alright, what are we gonna do? First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Down! See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. All right, yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Just keep pushing! Shit! Push! Uh, End of the road. What now? We're gonna get around the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously, this time. I'm not fucking around. You gonna cover me? If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you wanna go first, that's fine too. I'll go first. Atta boy, Russ. Haul ass. I'm good! Heads up! Nice! As soon as you start shooting, I'm coming! Now what? We get over there and we should be good. Go! Life. Whatever. 
We got more work to do. Let's see if we can get in around back. I'll sneak up on this asses. Follow me. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Watch out for that. What's the problem? No. No problem. Then come on. Russ, come on. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking quiet. We're gonna sneak up on this son of a bitch and take him out. You hear me? Not a fucking beep. Let's go. I see him. Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. I think I saw a guy. No shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Just jump out and grab him. Your call. You monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here! Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook! First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying and now she can see your face. Shut this guy up! can't handle this. Agreed. Look at how much progress we've made. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please just get the fuck out of here. Please leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Shit. See? Worth dodging some bullets? What the? Relax. You're my boy, Russell. Things are gonna be a okay. <laughs>